Uh, now, you probably know our next guest for patrolling the shores of Bondi, keeping beach girls safe and viewers entertained on Bondi Rescue. But tomorrow, three of the guys are instead flexing those swimming muscles in one of WA's most iconic events, the Rottnest Channel Swim. Hoppo, Reedy and Harrison join us now. Boys, hello. Welcome. Hello. How are you? Hello. Hello. Hello from Perth. So you are taking on the Rottnest Island Channel. Have you guys got something against being on land? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you're, you're. I, <laughs> I think we missed that one. Oh, the audio is not working. That really oh. helps for this. Guys, why are you doing the, the Rottnest Challenge? It's going to be a tough one, isn't it? Yeah, it's going to be a tough one. It's always good to come over and do it, but it's always a tough swim, you know, if you're doing about five hours or so. so. But the conditions look good, though, for tomorrow. Well, Reedy, on the conditions, Rottnest Island is not... Gentle little old Bondi. Are you worried it could be a bit sharky out there? Oh, look, there's plenty of marine animals out there, but obviously we've got Hopper who swims nice and slow and he'll take one for the team if we need him to. Yeah, shark plan, though, is it really stays in the water if we see a shark. <laughs> <laughs> now, guys, it's a 19.7 kilometre open water swim, I'm told, uh, which you're taking as a team. Why not make it 300 metres longer and then call it like an even 20 kilometres? <laughs> 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 Look, I tell you what, it might be the swim, but it's the, uh, the after party that happens on Rottnest Island after at the bar. So I tell you what, that's when the, uh, the athletes come into their own. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, it's a four-person team that you need to be on. There's three of you. Uh, as an ocean swimmer myself, you know, I'm willing to step in and be on your team. But I need to ask first, about every 500 metres or so, I stop for coffee and banana bread. <laughs> Is that a possibility? <laughs> You sound like an eastern suburbs in Sydney summer. Sydney <laughs> <laughs> coast, mate. Terrigal. Come and join the Scozzies. We're there every morning. <laughs> Perfect. Um, Jess, just talk us through this swim because it is a very long way. These are pretty difficult waters. I suspect many people watching would be like, N not on your life. Um, how prepped are you for this? <laughs> I've pretty much been tapering since I last did it back in 2019, so we're ready. But uh, no, look, it's a, it, it is going to be tough. We're going to uh, we're going to give it everything we've got. We'll probably start with 10 minute efforts each, and then we'll slowly reduce them to eight minutes, six minutes, and then it'll just be sort of go as hard as you can till you blow up, and then pass the baton on to the next person. <laughs> I don't like the sound of blowing up, but everything else made sense. Now, what I, what I want to know is you guys are lifesavers, but what happens if you get in trouble? Are there lifesaver savers that are, like, above you that monitor you or are you just screwed? <laughs> no, I'm just going to do what I always say, just float. If I get tired, I'm just going to float on my back. <laughs> well, what if, about uh, if, if you're of us on your back? In, if one of us gets, gets in trouble, we'll be... Uh, I'll tell you what, we won't have a job to go back to in Sydney. So uh, <laughs> we've got to give it a good crack. Well, Cody Simpson might be able to save you, right? I heard that he's doing this. So, Hoppo, if you're on your back, who's racing Cody Simpson? How do you take him down? <laughs> he might be way ahead of me, I think, the way it looks at the moment. But, yeah, hopefully he's around close to us so he can uh, rescue us if we need it. <laughs> um, and, guys, I think you've been back filming another season of Bondi Rescue. Uh, is it going to be a cracker? Yeah, it's going to be really good. It's, uh, you know, after COVID and now all the crowds are back at the beach and, you know, we've had the rescues, we've had, um, you know, plenty of first aids and the usual stuff that happens down at Bondi and different people turning up to make uh, the show what it is. So, yeah, it should be a good one. All right, we'll look out for Tom Cashman <laughs> waving out for saving. The new season of Bondi Rescue is coming soon to 10. Would you please thank the guys? Thanks, guys.